I just discovered the most customizable AI agent node in NAN. Let me show you. So we're all used to building AI agents like this, where we can plug in an AI brain, attach some memory, plug in different tools. And if we click into the AI agent, we can select our input to either be the chat trigger node or a custom variable. And then we have the ability to add some system instructions so that this agent can complete a specific task. But actually, this isn't the AI agent that I want to speak about today. What I'm going to show you is actually so hidden away in NAN. First, we have to click into AI agent, scroll all the way to the bottom, click on other AI nodes, Scroll all the way to the bottom again, click on miscellaneous. And then when we're here, we have this Langchain code node. Now, would you believe me if I told you that this is the most customizable AI agent node that you can get in NAN? So right now there's no inputs, no outputs. There's no AI brain, memory or tool nodes. But if we click inside, we can actually start to customize this node. And as we can see, I've got the ability to add inputs and outputs. Let's add our first input. Let's go to type, go to the very bottom and click on main. And let's add our first output. Once again, go to type, go to the very bottom and click on main. And now I've got an input and an output, which means I can now start to plug in different nodes into this AI agent. Let's say I want to add an AI brain, a memory and a bunch of tools. Back in our settings, I'm going to go to add input. Let's find language model. Let's add another input. Let's find memory and let's add our final input and let's find tool. And would you look at that? We can now connect our AI brain, a memory and a bunch of different tools. So let's say we want to add our first AI brain and we go for Anthropic. But actually, that's not enough for me. I also want to add in a second brain and I want to go to OpenAI. Isn't that crazy? I've now got two AI brains plugged into one AI agent node. Now check this out. If I click on memory for our actual AI agent, the options that we get over here are the exact same if I click on memory for our customizable AI agent. So they're actually using the same underlying architecture. Same thing with tools. If I click on tool, I can browse all the available tools that I have and I can do the exact same thing with our customizable agent and browse and connect absolutely any tool that I have available to me. If you want to see the full deep dive into the Langchain code node, head across to my channel. And while you're there, you can browse other AI automation and NAN tutorials. I'll see you there.